Sure. Because a lot of these are safety issues. Is there ever a safety plan required from Saddle or any of these other operators? Normally, when you drill a well of this course, a safety plan is required. Safety I'll plans. Let, I'll let the fire chief answer Safety that plans you. require require a multitude of things. One of them is 24-hour monitoring. In case there's a leak, okay. But but you're all right about the 600 foot. That's unsatisfactory. If the, vet, if the city can go and get 600 foot, if that's the minimum, they could at least notify people outside that 600 foot area. The, the oil companies have a, uh, a zone that's established through their studies on how they want to, on how their notifications go. They do that through studies and they do that through the Railroad Commission to get permits authorized. They use that to limit the number of people that they have to notify. Mm -hmm. I can speak from experience on that because I've been to the Railroad Commission, I've worked with the Railroad Commission to try to resolve some of these issues. The ordinance needs to change. The 600-foot six, the is all we can get, which I doubt it is. It needs, to, it needs to be expanded for notification because when you have 600 foot, there's only three houses within that 600 foot. Who's the advantage of it? It's the oil companies. You people don't get a say in any of this. That's right. So the ordinance needs to change. It needs to be updated. Mm -hmm. so Cape Hart's trying to do something. I'm not saying whether I, I was at the lap, that meeting when she voted yes. I was against it. I, I spoke against it because I think it's wrong. I think you people are suffering for it. I think after the fact is not the time to resolve it. You won't, you can't beat the oil companies, the railroad commission in Texas. You can file a protest when they put submit a well permit and you can spend thousands of dollars and go down there and go before the railroad commission, plead your case. But what you have to do as a city is you have to establish the ordinance, put some teeth in it, and if the, and if the oil company wants to pay the money to go to court and take you to the railroad commission, then they need to do that. That all said, you know, if we don't have leaders, they're going to vote no and stand up. Get leaders and stand yeah. up for them. Term limits. Yeah. Team term limits.